Abaco is one of the islands that is seeing an upswing in COVID-19 cases. For months, the island was COVID-free, but that is not the case today. Tonight, Jamila Mizek talks with a South Abaco's administrator who is hoping for a positive turnaround. At last report, the island of Abago has recorded some 44 confirmed COVID cases. And with seemingly rising numbers, Administrator for South Abago and Moores Island, Donald Rold, says it can be concerning. Once it's rising, there's always a concern is what do we do to um, alleviate the problem and, and solve the problems. And I know that the health officials here in South Abago and Moores Island is working previously to correct that problem. Roll says to his knowledge, most of the persons who contracted the virus are either related or have been working closely together. Now he says he believes most residents are taking the necessary protective measures, but he's using this opportunity to encourage residents on that northern island to continue to do their part to help stop the spread. I think most of them are, but we, you know, like any other place in the world, you still have that little small mining amount of persons uh, not uh, adhering to the, the emergency orders put down by the competent authority. But the most important thing is that we have a, a, um, an experienced and effective um, healthcare system and leadership, and we just need to carry out what is said and what is mandated by those officials to keep us safe and healthy, wear your masks and to social distancing, and this is going now, during this time, the government has been providing food assistance to thousands of Bahamian families using the National Food Distribution Task Force. The administrator is giving this update on the national food program on that island, as he says those who are in urgent need are being facilitated at this time. The national food program is working very good in, our, in my area, especially South Africa and, and North Island. We have a certain time and a schedule that we adhere to and it's going very well ma'am. There are much uh, the people of Mars Island and South Africa is much appreciated with regards to the food program. Jamila Mizek, Saturnas Network News.